Hello everyone and welcome back to This Week in Mythic Plus. This week we have Bursting, Skittish, and Tyrannical, so let's go over each of these affixes. Now for Bursting, whenever a non-boss enemy dies, every player gets a debuff that makes them take 10% of their HP as damage, and this effect does stack, so that means that killing 10 mobs gives you 10 stacks of this debuff, making you take 100% of your damage and causing a wipe. The next affix is Skittish. And this makes the tank in the dungeon generate 75% less threat than normal. And the last affix, Tyrannical, every boss has 15% more HP and does 15% more damage. Now with Bursting, we are going to have a lot of unavoidable damage in the trash for this week. And every boss fight is going to be a lot longer as well. So keep that in mind while we go over what everyone should be doing. Tanks, you should be keeping the pulls that you do to less than 6 mobs this week. If you start pulling packs of more than 6 mobs, 7 and above, you're almost going to guarantee at least one person goes down when all these mobs go down. Especially if your DPS staggers the deaths a little bit and you might get one tick of the first debuff and then keep stacking up after, it adds up to more damage over time. Something that you should be doing before every pull and every boss pull is checking on your healer's mana. This week is going to be very intense on your healer's mana since they're going to have to be doing a lot of AoE healing and a lot of very quick healing to recover between pulls. Remember to use your cooldowns on any of the bigger pulls and on any of the big hits for the boss fights. So whenever you do one of the big pulls, you're going to be taking 60 to 70% of your HP as damage. So the less damage you can take from the actual mobs will help out. Also for the boss fights, since they do have fortified this week, and we are now working up to a plus 15 for loot, remember to use your cooldowns whenever those big ability hits are coming in. For this week, you should be specking more survivability and maybe even equipping a Pridas if you have it and it helps you out. And this is all to kind of mitigate damage over time of the debuff and of the boss fights. Keep your taunt ready and use your DPS cooldowns as soon as the pulls start so that you can make all of the mobs stick to you. DPS, you should be AoEing all of the mobs down at the same time. They should all go down within 2 seconds of each other, and if they're being staggered a little bit too much, sometimes it's best to completely stop DPS, let your bursting stacks fall off, and then continue DPS after. If for some reason you get a pull that's bigger than 6 if you're running something like lower Kara or someone body pulls, then make sure you stagger the kills, let the stacks fall off, and then continue damaging. If you have Pridas, some defensive cooldowns, or any self heals, I do suggest keeping those handy this week or equipping the Pridas this week, since bursting is going to slow down the time between pulls. Also to note with Skittish, don't start a pull by using all of your DPS cooldowns as soon as the pull starts. Give the tank a few global cooldowns to catch up with threat and then go all out. Healers, bring water this week. You are going to need it, especially between pulls. You're going to be doing a lot of big AoE healing and that's going to be a heavy drain on your mana. Also, don't be afraid to speak up when your mana is low. This week, a lot of the wipes are going to be because of bursting. Now, bursting is countered by you, the healer. So if your mana is low, speak up. Let them know that you won't be able to heal bursting if they keep pulling with you having such low mana. As soon as you see the mobs dying this week, you should start throwing out all of your AoE heals that you do have to start counteracting the effects of bursting as it's ticking on you. You should also stagger your cooldowns on big boss abilities because your tank is going to be taking a lot of damage. And Apridas will also help you this week just because it'll help take the focus off of healing yourself and you can continue healing your group. Overall, this week is a 5 out of 10. It's pretty average, and that's because one affix is relatively tough and slows you down, and that's going to be bursting. But the other affix skittish, as long as your DPS mines their threat and your tank keeps taunt ready, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. Tyrannical will make sure that you don't ignore any of the boss mechanics and that's going to come around and make boss fights a little bit more difficult. But overall, with this week, it's going to be a relatively average week. So this week, you can try to get your plus 15 again, get your practice in for the Mythic Plus Invitational Pre-Qualifiers that start next week. And if you like what I do, want to help support the channel, go ahead and visit my Twitch or my Patreon down below. And as always, good luck out there.